visit any of the rocky shorelines along the west coast from Canada all the way down to Mexico and you're sure to notice the rocks covered in these tiny crabs if you look close enough. And if you look even closer, you'll see them blowing bubbles. But why? In this video, we'll explore some crabby fun facts as well as the reason for this unusual behavior. These colorful beauties are striped shore crabs, also known as lined shore crabs. They live on the rocks and in the hard mud of the tidal zones and also among mussel beds. Green algae makes up most of their diet, which they eat by pulling off the rocks and bringing to the mouth with their large pinchers. But they will also eat small animals too, like limpets, snails, or mussels. They've even been known to turn cannibal and eat other crabs when their shells are soft after molting. As vicious as they can be, these little crabs are also an important food source for shorebirds and other animals. Even raccoons love them and can often be found reaching between the rocks to try and catch a tasty oh, snack. Yeah, that good. And the best part is, you'll often see them blowing bubbles. That's right, you can find these guys just covered in bubbles. But don't worry, it's perfectly normal. When out of the water, which is about 50% of the time, they must keep their gills moisturized. And it's thought that the bubbles are caused by air passing over this moisture in the gills when the crab is oxygenating itself on land. These adorable striped crustaceans are one of the very few crab species in the world that spend half their lives on land. And they're able to do so by blowing the bubbles. Do you know any students interested in participating in science fairs, student research, or publications? Be sure to check out our Student Research Academy at thecuriocat.com. 